this start okay, has infinity potential. Combos like this are what makes magic amazing. How's it going, boys? Are you tired of playing basic, boring, bland red aggro? Well then, in that case, I got good news for you. This is super advanced, hyper red not aggro. It is beautiful. It does everything. It gives you chromosomes at the end of the day. It's like magical. Oh yes, you thought you can donate your chromosomes previously because there's an endless supply? This deck will literally double that endless supply. And the idea is easy. We use things like Urebrisk. We use things like Oyer, Axonil, and things like Chandra. It's absolutely amazing. Here's an egg because who doesn't like eggs? It is beautiful. Absolutely crazy. Do we have creatures? Yes. Here's one Flame Breaker Keeper Eater. And he does a lot of damage because when he, this thing is on the board, everything does a minimum of four damage. And it's beautiful, trust me, boys. Oh, yes. Four damage per pop, so many different small spells, big spells, medium spells, everything spells. And, again, did I mention the Chandra? She has a dress, and she's arguably dressed to kill, if you know what I'm saying. In any case, a bunch of lands, two mistress foundries, I don't even know why they're here, honestly. 22 lands to be specific, 2.3 average mana cost, and that being said, without any further ado, let's go farm some chromosomes. All right, boys, look at this. The perfect hand, the perfect everything. I love it. Also, question, when is the new expansion coming out? But only for the most smartest of magic aficionados. Also, did he seriously candy trail and choose to put keep everything on top? That is crazy. But crazy or not, I think it's fine. Okay, no longer I think this is fine. Wait, is he... Oh! It's Jink vs. Jink! Amazing! Wow, well, how is this gonna end? Hopefully in my favor. Not gonna lie, hopefully in my favor. Do this, got two lands, not even that bad, not even that bad. Pretty solid if you think about it. We'll be able to do this. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Discarding a card, do I discard the land? Who honestly knows? Do I discard this? I don't know. Again, I don't know. Well, in any case, whoa! Chief! He's going to deal damage to himself at this rate. Also, that was a very quick uh, get ditch the impulse. Huh. Well, whatever. Do this. Let's see. End of festivities is actually good. Rendering flame could be good, depending on the situation. So, we're going to see how it goes. I probably don't need uh, the... Yeah, this. This. Probably don't need that. Wait, did I already play a land? Did I... Did I not play the right land? I'm not sure. No, I did play the right, right land. You see, to play this effectively, you need to not know what you're doing. Because if you do not know what you're doing, your opponent damn well doesn't know what, uh, what you're doing. And that is the easiest way of winning games. Trust me, boys. Definitely a Super Omega play. Probably don't need to end the festivities here. And also, hopefully... Ooh, a Urabrisk. That is pretty spiced, not gonna lie. Anyway, time to deal damage to Liliana Planeswalker. Nice. End of festivities. Still no end of festivities. Okay, the plan is real simple. We probably drop him, and then we, you know, pew pew and stuff. It's gonna be great. The problem is... Okay, that's, that's definitely something. It's definitely called the end for a reason. Alright. Also, wait, is this actually a real play? What did you even do? Enter, search your library for the basic planes. Well, I guess that's the best way for him to ramp. Or he could use the creature. I like that this can actually turn into something useful. <laughs> useful. But at the same time, I, I, I don't know how much of a fan am I. In any case, got a land. Not bad. Should I just flame? Yes. Yes, boys. We are doing it. My god, are we doing it. Okay. At this point, we will sooner or later not run out of lands, and it's beautiful. Well, not lands, but we're, go we're, we're gonna be able to actually get this. Ooh, wow, that's that, 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 that's a lot of stuff. Let's see what's his response to Urabresk, Kun. Probably not much. Is he gonna remove it? Who knows? 
But if this case actually solves in this situation, my god, that's gonna be beautiful. My god, is that gonna be... Huh? Uh, that's that, that's an ineffective virtue of nothingness. Okay. Okay. Okay, I, I see how it is. Double. Mm -hmm. Right, I don't like that. Well, I, he, he, he has more HP than he started with, which is arguably big bad. But then again, I can do this, and finally, we, go, we get to solve the case of, you know, stuff happening. Ah, oh, yeah, boy, look at that. Ah, oh, good, good, good. At the beginning of your upkeep, discard and then draw a bunch of stuff. Effectively, three cards per turn. It's pretty, pretty good, considering most things, honestly. And now, we can deal some damage. No, definitely don't need another one of those. But you know what do we need? A Mishra's Foundry. Oh yes. Uh, this card. It's so underrated by the way, it's absolutely crazy. Well, it's there's a reason why it's underrated. It usually kind of doesn't work exactly. Arguably it's the best if you have pure burn. What is pure burn? I have no idea. I'm just making stuff up as I go. It's effective though. So, we ditch this, the eggs need to be sacked, it is, it, it's just the way that we do- Ooh, what a brisk. <gasps> Morally! Oh, and he surrenders anyway. What can I say, boys? I'm special. It's not often you see a mono-red 2.1 average mana deck that needs to mulligan wizards, but I will do it. Because why? Well, mostly because, uh, forced. But, you know, it's, you know, let's assume I wasn't, okay? We did get the case of the Crimson Pulse, which makes no sense, by the way. How is the pulse not crimson? Its blood is like, crimson. Whatever, whatever, whatever. These are small semantics, and this is a greedy freebooter. Questionable. He probably wants me to delete him, but I will say no. Your, co your, your freebooter dude is going to survive until the end. Also, I turned, down, uh, turned on my uh, headset, and... I, I can hear the two sound it does. Man, that's actually really loud. How do you people actually live with game sounds on? In any case, our opponent just did a collector's vault. I am officially extremely confused and most likely not appreciative of the situation. So, what are we gonna do? Well, at this point, probably not much. We're just gonna take the hits from the free... Okay, I'm turning off the headset. Seriously, how do you people play with game sounds on? I don't know. Nor I want to actually know. Okay, so. The idea is simple. If we get this, there's no way he does anything to actually stop us. And at this point... That's telling. Well, it would be telling if I actually knew what this card did. And since he discarded it, I will argue that I don't need to read the card. Obviously. Uh, yes, a, do a, do a double of those, uh, not today, I guess. Flame with fire, another one, not even that bad. Rendering flame, I have a feeling I want to keep that, honestly, considering there could be some... Negative consequ- Whoa! Okay. Uh, I, get, I, I get the hint, wizards, lands, that they're, they're a thing. Okay, how do I ditch the lands? Honestly, I should not be playing uh, with cases. Arguably, we should not be playing the thing that. Oh, oh, you see? You see what I told you? Rendering flame. Very rendering. Very on point, also. So that's kind of good. Okay, got more of this shabazzle. Not even that bad. And, well, we play this, play a lane, do something, and. Well, I bet I got the stage for a lot, I guess. I don't know what you do. What are you? Draw card, discard card, no one cares. The card. Okay, Ve very cool. V very cool. Okay, I have a feeling... Wait, I can't actually have two cases. That would be bad. At the beginning, something happens. Hmm, that's not a good happens. Okay. Wait, what did he do? Oh, Shreldrick Edict. I guess that's impressive. Well, to be fair, I could technically try and go for something amazing. Giga Chad plays or whatever. He's gonna draw a card and this card a card. He's searching for a Shreldred, that much I can tell you. Should I keep the light up the night? By the way, by the way, you know? I ain't the biggest Ch Chandra fan in the universe, boys, as we all obviously know. But, 
Oh, wait, you can't see her. But, I mean, Chandra arguably has some qualities to her. I think it's a light, it's slightly obvious, right? In any case, let's put this back, and now let's put the cat on purple. Because I am running out of options and I can't do this. Wait, how much does this cost? Too much. That That's how much it costs. Do I want to risk the case? Uh, I mean, I'm not going to get it down any other way, so I, I might as well at this point. I might as well. Okay, another one of those. Not that bad, not that bad. Okay. What, is, what does this do? Loot becomes a copy of target creature. Oh, from the graveyard. Very impressive. Also, beseech the mirror. Classic. I guess this is kind of cool. It's also a fey. It's a shapeshifter fey. Very very cool. Oh, he's using this card back. A man of culture. I mean, culture, culture right here, you know. That's some good culture. Anyway, what do we do now? He's ramping. <laughs> I'm never getting rid of this. <laughs> he, he can forget about it, okay? Right, so what do I do? I don't want to solve... Well... Man, you, you should be allowed to not solve the case if you feel like it. Just saying, second breach, besiege the mirror. Uh, restless reef. Yeah, at this point, it seems like I'm gonna mill myself, honestly. Okay, what are my plans? I can technically flip this if I get something that does more damage. But will I get it? Okay, okay, that's that's nice. Do I wait? I have a feeling I wait, yeah, I, 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 I definitely wait, because this is whatever damage uh, this is supposed to be, I think. I, I, I think, I'm not sure. I'm not a professional at flipping this back, because that's typically not what you... Ah, uh, hello there, Shreldred Beldred. What's your name? What's your... Can you stop, by the way? Can, can, you, can you just, you know... Not? Uh, can you just, like, not? I'm, oh, wait, I needed to wait. Ah, uh, I'm an idiot. Well, I mean... Hey, we can't all be perfect. You know, we, we can't all be... Sometimes stuff happens. And, you know, it's just... It's just how the world was built. I don't know what this still does, but I'm assuming it's some kind of reanimation bs -ity. Hmm. It seems I was exactly right. Okay, not dead after. Yeah, I think I think the cut name kind of says it all, honestly, huh? In any case, uh, that's cool. Draw card. Ooh. Okay, okay. I think it's uh, I, I think it's time to pump it up. So right, uh, first things first. We do this for six because yeah, that Shreldred is annoying and a problem. Okay, we got. Oh, because it deals one, I was thinking, wait, why can't I end the festivities here? That's because I'm an idiot. Easy solutions to easy problems. Okay, okay, we still have light up the stage. Flashback, remove X loyalty counters from a planeswalker we currently don't control. If you cast this spell this way, X can't be zero. I don't know, I, I don't even know what X can't be zero means this way. Huh? If I remove zero, whoa! Ha 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 ha! That is as sad of a desperation move. As wait, wait, wait! Does he stay like that forever? Woo huh? That is the dumbest thing I have ever seen in my dumb life. Wow! Wowie wooa! Okay, I, I guess I'm flipping it. I'm, I guess I'm really just flipping it at this point. Because we're, we're kind of almost at the point where we can do stuff. And stuff is cool most of the time. Okay, 4 HP left. Not even a problem. Watch, he actually drops another Shreldred exactly when I have the case of the no one cares. And I cry myself to sleep. Or in the crying corner. Right there. I mean, the crying corner is named the crying corner for a reason, boys. It all, it all, it all checks out, one might argue, even. Okay, okay, okay. So, the good part about this is, 
Both of these things solve themselves. Uh, okay, I'm too stupid to say what I mean, but you're gonna see what I mean. Aha! Like, wait, I actually know what you are. You're super frustrating and dumb. <laughs> okay, so watch this. First resolution of the case of no one cares. Motherfucker. I need, I need to, I need to do the trigger thing. Okay, well, uh, yeah, well, there, there, there goes my hopes and dreams. Don't know about you. Uh, gameplay? Auto fix? Auto choose replay? A, a sign called auto order triggers. Yeah, that's gone this time. That's, that's definitely gone this time. But now we're gonna do this and deal some more damage. Oh yes, oh yes. Well, actually, I don't know if, we, if this even works that way because you see, yeah, the thing is, I, I, yeah, I, I literally have never tried it because I try to not get two cases like the plague because it's really dumb and annoying. But then again, wait, am I dead? It's crew one. Lord Muppet is different. Oh no, he's gonna draw a greedy freebooter. It's over the draw right. What the fuck is even that? Well, it's dumb. But if it works at the end of the day, is it? Yes, it's still dumb. The fact that it works doesn't mean it's good. Also, that's slightly hilarious. So this guy's playing a jink copy deck. Don't hit me. Don't be that guy. Come, come, oh, come on. Yeah, that's, that's slightly unfair. Three lands, let's go. Also, you know what I find ridiculous about playing Mono Red? Typically, Mono Red ends up being the color that actually has the most draw in the game. In Historic, because the typical Mono Red uh, average mana cost is one, uh, things like Experimental Frenzy, um, is almost draw five cards per turn and stuff like that. Red is so good at this. And look at this, you have the case, uh, you have here, a Crimson Pulse case, and then you have the, uh, the Bonehead Dragons, not dragons, but dinosaurs. There's, there's so much stuff that just doesn't make any sense. And this is now a good play. Now the question is, do I ditch the land? Yeah, 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 probably. We're gonna draw one. Ooh, we draw two lands. I thought it's gonna be slightly different, but that's okay. Brotherhood's end to end the Brotherhood. It makes sense if you have watched. Well, actually, it doesn't. Full Metal Alchemist has nothing to do with actual Brotherhood being ended. Ha ha ha. And also, this is a good hand. This, this start okay, has infinity potential. Combos like this are what makes magic amazing. That's gonna be uh, the, the start for uh, the video probably. So, you know, just so just so it sounds way more impressive than it actually is. Oh, he got a big boy. That's, that's amazing. I don't like it though. In any case, what do we do now? Do we shoot the whoop? I mean, we could. Two, one, three. Ouroboros, power of transform, under, uh, when was it? Oh, if you cast three or more sorceries. Three, one, one. Yes, we can actually do this. This is amazing. So this is a little bit pointless, honestly, but hey, it is what it is and it's amazing. Again, we have so many actual super ridiculously potent openers. It's kind of hilarious, but we usually don't get them. Oh, man. Well, that's just life, boys. You sometimes win, you sometimes don't. And when you don't, remember, it's not your fault, obviously. Okay, should have attacked first, by the way, probably, but you know, I'm not a smart man. I'm just an ex uh, extremely pro bono man. It makes no sense. But whatever, whatever, whatever. Deal three damage. Dude, this guy's pissed, okay? <laughs> he just absolutely got obliterated. Oh no! And now we're risk, uh, we're gonna Brotherhood's end and, you know, 2 HP. He has already technically lost. There's nothing he can do about this. And then we're flipping the case and it's gonna get even a wilder. Oh, wait, actually, no, 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 no. Relax, boys. We got this. We got this so good. Okay, we got this so good. Good game. 
How do these hands just keep on happening? I don't know. We have currently 24 lands because I got annoyed, ditched the eggs, and added Bone Horde Dra uh, Dracosauruses because they're actually really, really good at doing things. So, yeah. Uh, maybe we don't keep the lightning strike. I mean, there's, there's a chance that completely backfires, but there's also a chance that that's amazing. In any case, I'm seeing what, what's gonna happen. Let's put the cat on. Assassins? Wait, is that a bird assassin? That's crazy. Okay, at least we're playing against other uh, other jank enjoyers, which is nice. Though he is a Kaito avatar, and I have absolutely zero respect for him. But, hey, we can't all be winners. Are you an assassin? No, you're a pirate. <laughs> ah, that's a lot of birdie boy assassins. Okay, when did you do things? I don't actually remember. In any case, reckless impulse, because I am reckless, that's for sure. Aha! Things just happen. I like it. Do I attack? Ah, uh, yeah, sure, why honestly not. Okay, four different cards, was it? Or five? As long as there are five or more mana values among cards in your graveyard, that did not tell me anything. At the beginning of your... If there are three or more creature cards in your graveyard, put up... Okay, 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 I, uh, I feel you. Also, now he doesn't attack? Seriously? Is that really a choice? At least we're mowing down this guy. Well, now he gets to mill two cards. Whoa! Hot. Okay. We reckless impulse yet again, boys. Choices have been made. Because I knew that we're gonna exactly get that. And now I'm ditching this because yes. <laughs> we're dealing damage. It's it's working. It's it's working. The ramping exile. <laughs> this is gonna be. He doesn't block again. Why do you even have the f uh, greedy freebooter? Are you? Is it like a sacrifice play? That, another one. Is this gonna be another AFK freebooter at this point? Because it kind of feels like it. Not gonna lie. And also, Omega plays much. Watch this. Watch this. Bam. Bam. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. I know. I know. That's that's pretty good. So this is the dream. How often does it happen? Never. <laughs> Unless wizards want to give us a win because we have been a good boy. We lost the game, so you know we we are definitely a good boy currently. Uh, I lo I love being valued for who I am, not just a piece of hot meat. Thank you, wizards, for appreciating me. Oh, what the hell is this? Well, I know what that is. Rhetorical question, I feel. In any case, uh, he's dead. <laughs> you know why? Because finally, Amazing Hand does amazing things. Potential, potential, potential. Two lands, but I'm, I'm feeling it, boys. This is red. This is a mirror match. Well... Well, it's not gonna be a mirror match of, well, actual mirrors, but it's gonna be close enough. So, I'm going to leave end of festivities here, because the reality is... Yeah, I don't know what the reality here is. The reality is that we can do things. And hopefully, end of festivities actually gets a little bit of value here. I should... Ooh! Ooh, someone just did a big boy thing. Wow! Okay, you get your free draw, or, you know, whatever the hell you you want here. Oh, wow, that's, that's annoying. That's actually really bad. Well... Could have been, that part could have been better, hehe. <laughs> In any case, let's do this. Let's drop the Chandra. It's pretty, it's, it's a pretty simple concept. Then we do this, still deal a little bit of damage and, and the festivities. Okay, with foolproof plans like this, we can, we can do a lot. Okay, also we can reckless impulse, drop a lane, plus Chandra, play this, or lightning strike. I'm assuming, I, I'm assuming. I'm assuming I'm gonna need to lightning uh, save lightning strike for something that he buffs up with the etchings. Now this is a tricky matchup because we are playing red and we're trying to use our brain power. But this guy is is playing red and well his effective uh, game style is now imagine this was my keyboard. It is by the way, and then he just it's dumb. Okay, hopefully he doesn't get rid of my, uh, my my Chandra. That would be... Oh, he doesn't! Weak! So, so weak! 
Oh no, the weakness. Oh, that's that's just sad. That's just that's just wait. Well, how do I play this? Hmm, that's a very good question that no one should ever ask. Do I play this? No. Wait, actually, no. I need to play this because if he tries to go for the Chandra, I mean, uh, we're, we're still cooking. You know, we're still cooking. This is damage. This is L damage you. And now we need to actually be faster than him, which makes problems. Problem problems. Okay. He only has three lands, so his plays are limited. Which would be something I say if this was in mono red, because... Oh my lord, it's the worst mono red player I have ever seen before. Wow. Okay. Okay, that kind of piques my fancy. Nice, nice, nice. A land. Very not nice, though. Okay, so here's the plan, boys. We do this. And I probably think we YOLO on him at this point. Um, yeah, that... Well, wait, that Durabrisk is gonna do things. I like it. Also, I can actually get rid of uh, Godric, which is nice. But I don't think it's gonna be viable. Three lands, boys. He's, he's getting rid of... Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's also gonna get the plus thing. Probably. Oh, he's chickening. Nope, not chickening. Okay, okay. So. What do we do? Well, this is not ideal. Well, I mean, we don't really have a better play than this, right? Uh, we go for this because... Wait, no, 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 no. Let's, let's be 100% uh, fully safe. In case, in case he tries to buff that up. Okay, good enough, good enough. We flip that, that's good, that's big, that's big sauce. Okay, it's solved. Now we draw three cards per turn. That gives us advantages. What kind of advantages? I don't know. Okay, he does that. He's, he's a Muppet. That's, that's kind of blatant. And we probably lost because, again, brain power is not really appreciated in Magic the Gathering Arena. Or in Magic in general. It's arguably a big weakness, one might say. So, 3 HP. How much are we gonna survive? Not a lot. This costs one less for each creature that attacks this turn. Okay. Ah, yes. And there we go. Why? Because, well, 3 lands is, is a thing. Totino's Pizza Boy. Respect. Don't know what the Totino's is, but hey. Hey, someone has to deliver the food. And I like those people. Typically not. But, you know, I you I should like those people. In any case, Urabrisk, Draco Boy, and more lands. Beautiful, beautiful. So, what's the play here? We AFK... Whoa! Oh, right, this does nothing. I forgot. Nothing the card. It's good, it's good. Another land. Well, to be fair, we don't really have plays of our own currently. But I can tell you one thing, he's definitely not expecting a bonehead Draco monster. Ho oh, ho! No one does. No one does. That's the secret of Monore Red Boys. Also, remember when we did a version of this with Chimil? It was good stuff. It was good stuff. Admittedly, we didn't have the flamey boy, but you know, st still good stuff. Still good stuff. He has a swamp? That's sus and questionable. Well, he took the damage, and I bet he's not currently happy with the situation. Unless he drops a land and wipes. There is a chance that may happen, boys, because this definitely looks bad. This looks like an advanced amalgamation of Arcane Bombardment. Well, to be honest, everything that plays Big Score is an advanced... Hello? There's no way he's gonna double remove with the Chandra plus two. That would be that would be highly. Whoa! Wait, no, that does not do anything. Why did you even do that? <gasps> he's gonna minus. Oh no! That's so annoying and frustrating. Well, I guess that works. I was slightly confused. What's what's about to happen? But our boy, our boy made it clear. I hate him on a personal level. Okay, pizza delivery boy. 
Uh, we, we, we need to change how things happen here. Admittedly, we're still kind of pumping and we're still kind of in the lead. If you ignore the fact that he has six cards. Ah, oh, there it is. The odd came bombardment. Hey, expected things are very expected, one might, might argue. Anyway, if he does not do, do a miracle here, we win. And this is probably not going to be good enough to do a miracle. What is this? It's a land. I don't like this alternative art. It seems cheesy. Okay, I don't know what that did. I'm assuming it's bad, though. Oh, wow, it's destroying stuff. Wait, 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 wait. Choose a target opponent and destroy a target land. Okay, okay. Wait, what? I'm, I'm confused. What just happened? Um. What? Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm really confused. What, what the hell just happened? How did this not actually destroy it? To target- f Oh, one to creatures. Okay, he messed up. Ah, I see, I see. Good, good. I like when he messes up. What do you get? Okay, I mean, sure. It is annoying, though. I'm not gonna lie. It's definitely what you would con uh, uh, you know, call annoying. There is a chance he gets rid of the bony boy. Huh. Okay, he does more. Is this gonna work this time? No. I like how he destroys the land. <laughs> well, he did just get draws there, so that's bad. Man, that's a pretty good hand to be uh, putting under, though. Okay, okay. We win if we get to attack, because it makes sense, right? It just makes sense. And another one. Oh, it's so Joker. It's so Joker. What, do you think you're gonna win against me? Oh, you have not been pit. I mean, that's impressively bad to a degree, though. That is that is, that is definitely Im impressively bad. Okay, well, the uh, wait, wait, wait. No, oh, I still win. Ooh, for a moment there, I thought that I uh, clutched the vi uh, victory. Uh, well, well, defeat out of the jaws of victory. By the way, a classic. So, works pretty well, all things considered. Good game.